السلام عليكم ورحمه الله وبركاته ليز كلاس با كلاس 5 اي ار اي كلاس 5 كنت لسه ديز مستر عبد الملك محمد دي وان تاس طلاب دايمشن لاكس اند ذا دايمشن لاكس وي هاف اوبشنال بلايرز ا يو اول اوف اس نو ذات ذا اوبشنال بلايرز ار اولسو كول سمر بلايرز دي كونسيست قبليه بلاير بعديه بلاير ثلاثه دوحا They consist also salat witr, tarawih, tahajjud. All of them are called optional prayers. Let us see together optional prayers and their and more explanation about them in our next part. In this part, let us see together what optional prayers. Optional prayers. These are summa prayers. They are also called nafila. They are also called nafila. It's not compulsory to say it, but failure to observe them amount negligence of one's religion duty. So these optional prayers they are very important. We need to pray them uh, before and after our prayers and any other time. Uh, so and we need to uh, practice them and we need to pray. Uh, in our daily basis, this is one of our Prophet Muhammad uh, practices or this that we used to observe them. And uh, they include, so these optional prayers include, as I said earlier, Qabliya, Ba'diya, Duha, and among others. And among others. Let us see in our next part, um, there are more explanation. In this part, we will stay together and Qabliya and Ba'diya Salah. Qabliya and Ba'diya Salah. These are Sunnah prayers said before and after Farad prayers. They are also called Tuwatib. Tuwatib. So, these Qabliya and Ba'diya prayer are Sunnah that are said before and after the Farad prayer. They are also called Tuwatib. That is the other name. Qabliya means before while Ba'diya means after. So, any Sunnah prayer that we perform before the Farad prayer is called Qabliya. And any Farad prayer, that, uh, and every any any Salah that we pray after the Farad prayer is called Ba'diya. They consist of two Raka'at. Generally, it's better to say these prayers at home. However, they can also be said in the mosque. That, that's the most important things. So, these prayers are meant to correct the mistake we make in our Farad prayer. So, these prayers, they will rectify and clean the minor mistakes that we did during our Faral prayer. So we need to observe them always in our, in our daily basis. Let us see the next part. Uh, in the next part, we have, and we will see together something called Duha, Salat al-Duha. This Salat al-Duha is also very important. A highly recommended Sunnah prayer uh, performed between sunrise and noon, between sunrise morning up to noon around 12. Of. So this prayer are prayed between that time. The word duha means full morning light. So the word duha means full morning light. Duha prayers has a minimum of two rak'at and maximum of eight rak'at. Our Prophet Sallallahu encourages us to fulfill three ibadah every day. Let us see together. First for three days every month if we can able. That's very important. Saying the duha prayers is also very important. Saying the witri prayers before sleeping. So these are three important things that our Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam encourages to do them. Encourages to do them. Encourages to do them.